Bench, if there's foul trouble, these rotations are going to be the rotations we will see on until the regular season. Rockets 3-1, and one. Heat 2-2 two and two in the preseason, coming off of another run to the NBA Finals last season. More on their crazy run to the Finals, one of the more improbable runs in the history of this league. There's Bam defending on the perimeter. Now walls off Smith, finds Brooks, comes down the baseline, got to shoot it. Shingoon steps under Love and then got it off. Looked like he was fouled, no whistle, stayed with it and scored. Moses Malone style right there, padding those stats, throwing the ball up and getting it back. Now to Shingoon, left block, working on the veteran Love, works baseline with a drop step, now back to his right, stays with it, whirls, and a little shovel shot, he's able to get it to go. There you go. You see the patience there from Al P. And what's important is for him to stay aggressive, keep taking those shots, and got the little jump hook to go, Craig. Yeah, his second make. He's already attempted six shots in the game. There goes Hero on December the 15th. Get it to him. The ball moves, and, you know, you got a group of defenders, so, you know. Jaylen blocked. Sorry. No, he's good blocked there, but Jalen can take that step. He's looked great tonight. Without a doubt, his best preseason game by far. Oh, he just lost Kevin Love that time. Almost the sauce. I'm not, I'm not going to say the sauce almost yet. Almost the sauce. Lowry into the lane. Another one. Shingun recovered. Two straight blocks. There you go. And good to see some energy coming back. And Al P's got a pep in his step. And look at this block here from Kyle Lowry. That's something that the Rockets had had in a, I mean, a very long time, Craig. And that's a foul on Hampton. And Shin, you, you wear in public. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, Hampton's second foul puts Alperin Shingun on the stripe. Shingun in two games against the Spurs in the preseason, John, took 18 shots, missed 16. <laughs> yes. I mean, that's shocking. When I saw that in preparation, I was like, wow, because he's 6'11. It's not like he's out there firing up three balls. I mean, everything he's taken is most of his shots are, you know, within three to four feet of the basket. So you can tell that length of Wembenyana had a huge impact on his ability to get, uh, you know, make shots. He's given a lot of that toughness and taught his young player, Fred Van Fleet, a lot in his time, their time in Toronto. Too strong, long wingspan of Thompson. Oh, there's some sauce. There's the hey. cross by Shingun. <laughs> <laughs> Love to see it. And when Alpi has the ball, you got to keep your head on the swivel. Oh, and that, did Smith hear the footsteps of Shingun? Look, how about yeah. Shingun? Great, great yes. offensive play at one end, hustling back the other end to stop the layup. And this is the Alpi. That was a true no looker, all right? Kind of how I feel working with you, big fella. Appreciate it. Iron sharp and iron, man. Pist Pistons got some intriguing young talent. Yes, they do. Shingun. Oh, that will count. That will count. <laughs> a little awkward possession there. Uh, uh, Kevin Love trying to bait uh, another charge and see if these feet get on the dot. Yeah, they're moving again. And I think he, that one little quick step back. Well, Craig, you like that from Alpi. You want to know why? Okay, you're in a bit of a drought. You know, it's, it's not just keep shooting the basketball. It's keep playing hard, keep doing the little things, and then your offense will come. And he's, he's not quite the sauce yet, but he's getting there. Here's the one thing you like is the Rockets are starting to create culture. A little sloppy play here. A lot of sloppy play here. Yeah, but the Rockets are creating that culture. And a Rockets Margaritaville shirt starting at just 29 no, that's normally that's man. normally your thing. And the Rockets first two points. Yeah, he's young and this is a big change. Much like with Jalen Green as we were talking about in the first half. This is his third year in four years. Shingun. Oh, he got it to go. Brian either got a piece of the ball or a piece of him. No whistle there. Shingun though able to muscle through for two. With the, with the dunk stuff layup. Well, I don't know what we call it. A little wedgie. And another block. He got another one. <laughs> his third again. He's going after everything at the rim. Got numbers. Thomas Bryant is hurt. The players didn't stop, which is No, yeah, important. they didn't stop at all. There's a term in sports, play through the whistle. You never know what might happen. Hey, Shane Goon just stays with it there. Here goes another block for Alpine. But it was Sam D'Alembert was out there playing. Sounds like it was worth it, Kyle Lowry. It was, it was so much fun. Oh, banked it shot there for Van Fleet. These veteran guys, they're getting dinners with the young guys. They're helping them with their game, helping them with details and ingratiated to the league. Yeah, good group to have.
with these young players as they continue to develop. That will count one free throw all the way for Shingun. Look at Fred Van Fleet. Look at him encouraging Alpron Shingun, knowing he wants his big fella to score more, but continuing to feed. 16 and 12 for him. Yeah, that's great work there, Vanessa. And the thing about Ime Udoka, he played the game. He knows the value.